There's not enough information uh, processing that's going on because there's too much information. In the last five years of most fields, if you were to try to read every article, there's typically between 50 and 100,000 documents that have been created. At an hour per document and 2,000 hours per year, that would be 50 years. So you'd spend your entire professional lifetime catching up in the last five years. So the idea of Omnity was, could we interconnect documents that were talking about the same topic because they were using the same rare words. So we can take hundreds of millions of documents and focus on the rare words of each document. And that lets us find documents that are close to one another in meaning. This is a very different way to interconnect knowledge than say a conventional search engine, which uses links. We had uh, an interview with a, uh, a journalist who was doing a report on internet addiction. And we dragged in her half written report and uh, what happened was we found clinical trials on internet addiction that were occurring in China using electroacupuncture. She never would have found those, an open clinical trial in China using electroacupuncture. You don't know what to look for if you don't know what's there. But with Omnity, you don't need to know what's out there. We're focused much more on knowledge discovery across patents, scientific papers, clinical trials, medical literature and that kind of thing. The National Science Foundation's Small Business Innovation Research Program is virtually unique in the world and it's one of the great differentiators that allow American entrepreneurs to globally compete.